the next the next startup created a bit of a challenge for us. Um, we absolutely loved their uh, business model. That was there was no doubt about that. We thought that they were uh, a pretty smart and capable team, but they were actually doing an ICO, and we reached back across the. Um, the startup bootcamp networks to start speaking about ICO. We didn't really have that much um, much experience in them, so we all sort of looked at each other. I remember speaking to Andrew about this, and um, we all said, "Let's give it a go." And we're so glad that we did, um, because just as the program started, um, these guys ended up raising uh, forty million US dollars in about forty five seconds. But that's um that's a lot of pressure. <laughs> but. I'll be honest with you, that's not as impressive as the team is and their business model and what they're hoping to do to the Australian market, which is completely revolutionise it. So I'd like to invite up on stage Nick from WePower. Thank you. Well, I hope that everybody still has enough power to listen to our final two pitches. So WePower was uh, created to uh, help the transition and accelerate it to 100% renewable energy future. However, to uh, go there, we need to tackle main challenges. And the main challenge for renewable energy development today is capital. We need more of it. The second problem is to connect more and more renewable energy to currently existing infrastructure. We all know that in the past uh, 10 years, the transition was amazing. And what happens uh, globally with renewable energy is very interesting. It changes the market itself. So we started a um, long time ago with centralized energy production, centralized energy delivery. And uh, now these days we see a lot of small decentralized energy production all around the world. But the financial sector did not manage to catch up with the process that we're currently uh, experiencing. So the model today is basically based around uh, debt and equity financing, um, procurement contracts, and uh, complicated offtake contracts as well. So what we have today, the tools that are in existence are highly concentrated. They are liquid, as if you have a contract for energy delivery, you'll probably not be able to sell a chunk of it to somebody else. They're very complex, and of course, they're local. So each country have their own system in place, and uh, when you enter other country or you wish to invest in another country, it becomes quite a complicated process. So what we power offers today is uh, kilowatt hour based smart energy contracts, which are decentralized in their nature, or they run on blockchain, as Richard mentioned. Uh, they're highly standardized and uh, they're global. So basically everyone who wishes to participate in the market can actually do so. So how WePower works. So whenever a new developer comes to the platform and uh, passes the due diligence process, he's able to issue uh, smart energy contracts for future energy delivery. This way, he'll able to uh, raise enough capital, well, 20% of the project itself to construct it faster than he would typically would and um, start delivery of energy to the final consumers. Buyers, because of this uh, much more simplified and streamlined process, are able to buy energy cheaper and uh, enjoy the power later on. So we're currently developing uh, WePower in Estonia, where we have an amazing team. Uh, we have uh, very good partners there, uh, such as Ellering, a transmission systems operator, Elion, which develops uh, wind capacity, new parks, and of course, a retailer. So we have a full cycle of energy trading that we are able to rely on to make our product a reality. This year, we're doing a test where we will run 11 billion smart contracts through the platform to test out uh, scalability of it. And uh, uh, soon we'll see the results of it. We're going to expansion mode now. And uh, we're happy to be here in Australia. And together with Startup Bootcamp and uh, corporate partners, work on bringing WePower to Australian market. Market is a bit different here than we have in Europe. So we need to tailor made our product to work here. We're going to work as a technology provider, working together with generators, retailers, and uh, retail consumers uh, to offer two different products. 
One of them would be uh, smart virtual uh, power purchase agreements. And a second one, a uh, product tailored for retail customers and retailers in the form of uh, energy credit token uh, that can be used not only for energy itself, uh, but also for better customer relationship. We are happy to announce our customer trials with Energy Australia and to work on uh, Thank you. Uh, to work on transparent supply uh, product offering, um, renewable energy financing options, and of course, uh, smart uh, contract-based energy purchase. We have a team of uh, 29 professionals with vast experience in uh, renewable energy development, in uh, grid operations, and complex IT infrastructure delivery. And we're excited to announce the launch of WePower platform today. Uh, where we could offer our clients that would join it, um, smart energy contract functionality, global marketplace for renewable energy, and of course, the services which everybody talked a lot today in form of grid flexibility. <laughs> I would like to thank you all for your time, I invite you to join our, us near our booth, talk more about what we do, and uh, invite you all uh, to our event together with Startup Bootcamp that we're gonna have later on for the professionals. Thank you. <laughs>